So once you create a new file in diagrams.net, this is what you see. So over here, just like with most of uh, applications, there is a menu bar on the top where you can access out many of these settings. Over here on the left side, you got access to different drawings such as shapes, as you can see, that you can bring in onto the main area. So you can see that you can access out basic shapes and different types of shapes right here. And you can also access more shapes and then you get access to more shapes just like this as well. So apart from that, on the top, you can see that there's like different uh, layout options like outline and then layers that you can access over here as well. You can close this and then rearrange it as well. So you can get it back over here as well, rearrange it, resize it just like this. So let me just close this right here. On the top, you can see that there is the zoom level that you can access as well and then work around with different zoom levels as well. There's the zoom controls, undo and redo, the layering options and formatting options over here on the top as well. And apart from that, there's the table incision and options as well. And there's uh, um, different shape incision and options as well. Over here on the right hand side, you can see that you got access to the themes right here. You got access to full screen mode right here and you have access to format options as well. You can also expand and collapse out the menu right here. Over here, you got the properties uh, which you can use to change out the properties of different shapes that may be there on the main drawing area. And over here, you can access out the text and range and everything as you can see. So this is the main working area where you can place and resize out the contents. And over here on the bottom, you got access to different pays in session as you can see right here. We're going to see all of these things in detail in upcoming lessons. So this is uh, the interface of the application that you can uh, work with in order to draw out diagrams. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.